the highly infectious and more uh, lethal second wave of uh, uh, pandemic uh, started to on on us uh, since uh, late uh, march and the uh, infections rate and uh, uh, death rates also were very acutely increasing and our uh, uh, infrastructure our hospital beds our facilities our equipments and everything we felt uh, we felt shortage of those things um, and it was like a crisis very serious crisis uh, at the when the web is started second web is started but uh, gradually we uh, took uh, very serious measures and took serious steps uh, to reduce and control the pandemic in this way we urge our friends all over the world the governments the uh, producers vaccine producers and others and philanthropic organizations as well to support us and i would like to thank all our friends our friendly countries our neighbors and other entire organizations who support us generously and we took other measures uh, of restrictions and maintaining social distance wearing masks etc and our people also were educated and they um, cooperated us and now uh, the wave is uh, under control and it is uh, going down um, about uh, um, we can say uh, more than 25 percent uh, 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 the wave is decreased uh, 75 percent is decreased and there is 25 uh, percent now uh, in existence Sir, yeah. and we are yeah and even now we are uh, also uh, trying to control and uh, there was a uh, shortage of vaccine uh, shortage of uh, oxygen shortage of cylinders yeah. oxygen cylinders and um, medical equipment etc like okay. uh, um, uh, uh, other so many equipments uh, uh, shortage we are feeling but uh, now we have uh, mm. uh, covered up we have make up uh, those uh, shortcomings and uh, there is okay. uh, not that sort of problem and uh, we now need uh, vaccine uh, 